Hi, I'm Steve Blosis, a product marketing manager from NXP Semiconductors here in sunny San Jose, California. Uh, today we're going to tell you more about the PCA9557, a new LED controller we've just released. Philips invented I2C over 40 years ago, but is still going strong, and the most current iteration is the new I3C bus, which operates at 12.5 MHz. Our product line offers the largest portfolio of general purpose I2C and SPI based products. Today we'll discuss the newest LED controller, PCA9957. Here's a view of the 24-bit LED controllers that we offer. We offer 100 milliamp 40-volt voltage source devices that control current with external pull-up resistor and 20-volt and now new 5-volt constant current devices which regulate the current internally. The advantage of the voltage source devices are there's an external resistor which allows the voltage supplies to the LED strings to be different, so it allows you to have different supplies for different LED strings to make the thing more efficient. And then the voltage drop is on the resistor, which is external to the device, so there's less self-heating. The advantage of the constant current devices are there's better accuracy for more consistency for the LED brightness, and there is no requirement for the external resistor. Uh, but you can't drop more than two volts across the device. The new device, PCA9957, is a daisy chain SPI compatible four wire serial bus like the PCA9745B, but it is 24 channels versus 16 channels, and it is five volts versus 20 volts. Using the five volt devices internal to the die allows us to have a smaller die and offer the newer device at a lower price. PCA9957 is a constant current LED driver optimized for dimming and blinking, and these are the same features that are on the PCA9745B, that 24 volt device. You know, they both operate the red, green, blue, amber LEDs. They both have 140 degrees C over temperature protection. They both operate at the 10 megahertz SPI bus. They both have a software reset in addition to the hardware reset. Uh, they both do the uh, 256 step group brightness and uh, blinking control from 0 to 99.6%. IREF registers to set the current gauge and they both operate 2.7 volt to 5.5 volt supply range. Now let's take a closer look at the block diagram and how the PCA9957 controls LEDs. Each LED has an 8-bit resolution which is 256 steps. There's a 31.25 kilohertz and the duty cycle can be adjusted from zero, which is totally out, to 100%, which is totally on. The group PWM also has an 8-bit resolution, 256 steps, and it has a fixed frequency of 122 hertz and an adjustable frequency between 15 hertz to once every 16.8 seconds. And this is used in order to do the blinking of the LEDs. And you can adjust the duty cycle from 0% to 99.6%. Each LED output can be off, on, which is no PWM control, set at the individual PWM controller value, or it can be both individual and group PWM control values. The output is set by the external resistor REXT, and internally you can adjust the current with a 8-bit linear DAC from 125 microamps to 31 milliamps. With, this is with REXT at 2K ohms. Radiation control. There are six selectable gradation controls groups, and each group has four independent registers to control the ramp up and ramp down time, the step time, the hold off and on time, and the final hold time. There's also two different modes for these groups. There's a single shot mode where the pattern operates once, or there's a continuous mode where the pattern operates repeatedly until you stop it. Safety, there's built-in open, short load and over temperature detection circuitry that's read by the microcontroller through the SPI bus. Additionally, there's a thermal shutdown feature that protects the device independent of the SPI bus. Output enable. There's an active low output enable on the device that can be used to externally PWM the devices to dim all the LDs or you could actually blink all the LDs from multiple devices. Why should you buy the PCA9557 from NXP? Well, we've got innovative parts, great quality, a large industrial base in order for upsides, and great customer service. For more information on the LED controllers, please visit nxp.com. And thanks for watching.